And that's what he attacked the very fabric of our society. A methodical gunman armed with two rifles and a handgun looking to kill officers. That's how investigators describe Gavin Long. It is the chilling and the sheer brutality of the shooting. There is no doubt whatsoever that these officers were intentionally targeted and assassinated. The suspected shooter considered an outside agitator who had been in Baton Rouge for several days before the attack. He came in here from somewhere else to do harm to our community and specifically to the law enforcement officers in our community. The community mourns the three officers killed, including a deputy who was trying to render aid to a Baton Rouge police officer. My deputy went down fighting. He returned fire to the very end. Investigators say the shooter was tactical in his approach, using buildings, including this beauty supply store, for cover during the gunfire. The Baton Rouge police chief says his officers responded exactly how they were trained to. They went to the fire. They didn't run. They didn't go the other direction. They didn't blow it off. They went straight to it. And I could not be more prouder of these officers. I cannot be more proud of my SWAT team. We've been questioned for the last three or four weeks about our militarized tactics and our militarized law enforcement. This is why, because we are up against a force that is not playing by the rules.